A new era has begun for UConn men's hockey as they begin their first season in the coveted East Conference. They'll be playing their home games at the XL Center this season, and while the team hopes for a large student turnout, that might not exactly be the case due to an increase in ticket prices as well as a lack of student transportation. The extremely competitive East Conference consists of impressive squads such as Boston College, Boston University, and Northeastern. Being the Huskies' inaugural season, a large student turnout at home games was certainly expected, but might not be realistic. UConn has decided not to provide bus transportation for the students to these games, which could be a lead to a very poor student turnout throughout the season. There has also been an increase in ticket prices. It will be $17 for single game tickets with no student discount. This has left many UConn students uncertain as to how many games they will attend this season. And in a season that is possibly the most important in the program's history, an overwhelming student turnout should have definitely been sought after. This is a very hot topic on campus and we thought we would go around and ask students how they felt about the subject. How do you guys feel about the increase in ticket prices and the lack of student transportation? I think it's kind of ridiculous. I think it's a high price to ask for and uh, not like having bus tickets to go to it uh, makes it a hassle to get there. Like I'm not going to pay like 17 bucks if I don't get a ride to the games. Like it doesn't make sense to me. So tough because like now that the prices are increased, like less and less students are going to want to go to the games. And plus because they're further away and now they're not providing transportation, it's going to make it even more difficult for students to get to the game. So less people are going to want to go. So I don't think it's that good. It's going to be so hard to carpool to all the games, and the increase in ticket prices is ridiculous. $17 is way too much money for one ticket. Only time will tell to see if students succumb to the drastic increase in prices and lack of transportation. It will also be very interesting to see if this policy continues in the future.